It's getting hotter outside, which means we're gonna see more of these guys. Even though they can be scary to some, they do serve a role and they are protected. 46 or 47, 48 species of snakes in Georgia, depending on what scientist you talk to. Uh, and, you know, probably a third of those or more are, you know, in decline or some kind of conservation concern. All non-venomous snakes in Georgia are protected, and it is illegal to capture, kill, or harass them on public and private land. You could be cited for killing a protected species, and then uh, the local court system will probably have a lot to do with what that fine actually is. Um, you know, but it could be up to a thousand dollars. Snakes eat rodents, which help control disease spread, and they are prey for other creatures, which makes them an important part of the food chain. We feel that if you educate people about them, they get a connection to them and they're not scared of them. If you don't like snakes, the best way to keep them away from your house is clearing debris to keep rodents away. If you do see one, you can spray it with a water hose to safely get it to slither away. There's a lot of products on the market to keep snakes away and I can tell you that none of those work and don't waste your money on them or they're really toxic to the environment like mothballs are a real popular one. It's easy to misidentify a snake so the best thing to do if you see one on the trail is give it plenty of space and leave it be.